<clears throat> Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day was created by Sir Victor Valentine. Now, Victor Valentine was a prick, and he only created Valentine's Day so that he could laugh at all the single people from his ivory tower with his wife, Velma Valentine. But then, Velma Valentine found this cruel as he bullied all their tenants with the day that he created to bully them, and so she left him. It's quite ironic, because every Valentine's Day to follow, he was alone and sad until his death on the 14th of February 1462, where he died sad and alone. You know, I don't, I don't, I'm not sure about this. What do you mean? I just don't think it's very funny. I... Well, duh, sir, that's why you left Mishi. Great, thanks, yeah. It's just kind of a dark opening. Uh... <sighs> Clarence, I said, why don't we just... Um... Where are you going? Sorry, sir. I've, um... Well, I've, well, I've got a date. You got a what? And bugger and hell, I'm already late. Gotta go, sir. You have a good day. Oh, oh Clarence. I... Great. Wonderful. Oh, oh, wait, I forgot my side. Kick. Oh. Happy Valentine's Day. So anyway, on with the video. Doesn't Valentine's Day suck? Oh. Am I gonna go over the 18 reasons why? Not a reference. Haha! <laughs> One! It's a grotesque consumerist holiday designed to make people feel awful. Whether you're dating someone or not. I'm reading these from some shitty list online. Two! There's an overwhelming pressure to eat chocolate for no apparent reason. I don't agree with this one because we should always eat chocolate. <laughs> you can't go out for dinner because if you do, everyone around you will make gooey eyes and you'll pay twice as much. That's a regular night and have to queue. I don't know what that's like because I've never been on a, on a date. Um, there's always that smug person that gets sent roses at work. Which is bonkers because roses die. Why are they a symbol for love? I don't believe in what I'm saying here. Apparently everyone has horrible Valentine's Day childhood memories. But I don't, because I don't celebrate Valentine's Day. It is a totally pointless day and there is no event that makes the 14th of February to romance. People also make their pets wear ludicrous things. Number nine, the lols. And that's just plain cruel. If you have a secret admirer, it can be kind of creepy um, trying to figure out who they are and kind of stressful and kind of creepy. And kind of stressful. Apparently love hearts taste gross. Um, so I don't know if that means like a sweet. Or the actual heart, because like that's not meant to be nice, and it's cannibalism. I'm running out of dumb phrases. fat cards are cringe beyond belief, um, and as if the intensity of your love can be summed up by some copywriter with apparent obsession of rhyming things with you. I don't know what that means. You should just send cute memes. Like this one. That's a cute meme. Isn't that cute? You get secretly jealous over other people's really imaginative romantic gestures. Which makes you hate yourself. I mean... No?
That's it. That was that was shit. Though. I don't know why I did that. Let me tell you the way to do Valentine's Day. Whack on some perfume. Whack on the romantic version of Skibidi Wap Get get them some randoms because they're great. Also get them sensations because they're also great. Guaranteed you're in there after that. Get them a dumb card, you know? Get them a card that says like Congratulations, you passed your driving test. But it's funny because it's it's not the same thing. Just order like a takeaway, you know? That's good. <laughs> Two. Get them a card that says like congratulations you died and then just that then say something a sweet thing like your eyes are like coconuts and then you're in there you'll be in there even more than you were with the randoms but the randoms will get you there already but now you're just even more in there you might even have sex already you know whatever that is you know skibbity just gets you in the mood this is the worst this is the worst i've got eyes in my veins This really is the saddest thing. It's, I'm not even trying and it's really sad. God damn. If you could just gonna sit around there moping all day long, then I will goddamn tell you the clone formula because I'm just so sick of Watching you sit there. It's ironic. W what do you mean? Well, because I've come to. <clears throat> oh! Hey, Claude. Dan? I, I thought you were out for yesterday. Um. Why on earth would I have been out? Well. Well, because it was Valentine's Day. Um. Why would I have Valentine's Day plans? I'm you. Mm, yeah, that that adds up. Mm. <sighs> um, are you all right? Well, it's just it's just amazing <laughs> how dumb you are. What? What do you mean? Well, it's just I guess I thought you'd recognize our host. When you saw him, didn't the scarf take you off? Red! You know, I'm hurt, for I thought we were friends, you know? I mean, I recognise you with that hideous beard. Well, I guess I just didn't recognise you without that hideous top knot. So, come on then. Walter's waiting for us. Red, I'm not going back. I'm warning you. It's amazing, you think you have a say in the matter? You are coming back with me, I'm- We have a very low budget. Oi, you little bugger. Claude, I didn't know you had it in you. Hmm. Little shit, tell me. Where's Dan? Where is he? Last I saw, he went out for Valentine's Day. Okay. 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 Fuck. Where the hell am I? Hello? It's a room that looks very similar to mine. Oh, well, you have my sincerest apologies. We're kind of starved for filming locations. Oh, shit. 
shit, how did I not even see you when I came in? That's besides the point. Now, please, come in. I insist. Nice haircut. Why, thank you. Now, enough of the small talk. Let's get down to business. One, I want the orb back. Two, I want Claude back. And three, I want the channel back. Now, you can keep all three if you beat me, but if I win, you give me all three. And I hear you thinking, what are we going to do to settle this agreement? Well, let's see if all those years in the closet paid off, shall we? Fuck.